What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Dungeons here on the Xbox One. So guys, today we are trying to get the Abomination Domination uh, achievement. So we are going to head to Overgrown Temple and the point is to beat this on either Adventure or Apocalypse Difficulty. Thank you, Java Update available. So guys, when this loads in, I will get back at you. Alright, so sounds like the shards making us some more bad guys to take down the abomination. So let's get it guys. Let's see what we got so far. Alright, so so far there's some ocelots. Oh, that's pretty cool. A lot of ocelots. Alright. Okay. I'm kind of stuck here. I can't see. There we go. I didn't see that spider. What is that that's burning? All right. Ooh, melon. Give me that melon. Those melons were kind of useful in our pacifist run of the dingy temple. Oh, great. I'm po they have poison on this level. Because of these things, I'm assuming. All right, time to party shake this up a bit. It's not really helping. So I'm going to need to take some of that. Alright, so we got a splitting path here. Really hope this ain't like a super giant level. <laughs> I don't want to have like another almost hour long video. Ooh. Especially because it's not necessarily that like playing for an hour is a bad thing because after this video ends you figure I'm going to go like I have to edit this, I have to render it, and then like I'm also going to do the seasonal challenges because actually the video you're going to see after this is hopefully me getting the cape for the seasonal challenge. So, but yeah, what I was saying is like, I don't mind playing for an hour. That's not a big deal because I'm going to be doing that, but it's just like the render time and the upload time and all that on an hour of video is kind of atrocious. So hopefully this one ain't too long. I am once again, what in the world is this thing? Oh, but it gave me mercenary armor. Better start watching my health here. Alright. That was kind of a little bit challenging. Especially because I couldn't see half the enemies because they were hidden. So if you ever want to have a challenge, just uh, face things that you can't see. That's the secret. But, okay, got a little bit of armor. Those plants are annoying. So, I guess now we just kind of run along here and do some somersaults and hope for the best. Tangle in the temple is our objective. Party shaker is kind of useful too. Because I don't have to like get like super close to people to actually like deal damage. I can kind of start damaging them already. Oh, I forgot to see what that was. That brew. Hmm. No, I'll find out eventually. Alright, so we have 36 arrows, so we're kind of hurting for arrows here. So, I'm going to do some of this. Alright. That was actually pretty destructive. Kind of got to watch here. I know my health is getting low. I'm going to wait to use that potion if I can. I'm gonna have to pop it. Oh yeah, figures, and then there was all that stuff sitting over there. Okay. Seems like poison is gonna be like a big deal in this world. Is there anything over here? I didn't, okay. Alright. Might have been some more enemies over here. There was. Somehow I got poisoned even though I dodged that. Maybe on video it looks like I didn't, but... Okay. So... Really? So I guess I gotta come over here because there'll probably be a matching button. 
could could have just made it like the door opened after I beat all those enemies. I guess it makes it more interesting. Alright, get back here. Alright, so we got a pretty big room here. Of course we have like those jungle spellcaster guys. I'm gonna pick that up. Bet you the door's gonna lock. Oh my. How did I ever guess? Da, 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 da. Probably have like a small boss battle or mini battle thingy here. Battle. I don't know why it's got a really weird accent there. Alright. I mean, those arrows. I need arrows so badly right now for the time being. Ugh. And spider. Alright, so is the chest worth it? Got a strength potion and a shadow brew, so no. <laughs> Looks like there's a little room over here. Yeah, that's right, I forgot my armor drops arrows and health potions. Psych. Psych. <laughs> Alright. This armor really needs to stun people more often. Well, there's a chest over here, so good thing we did come over here. Got an axe. I am going to grab those emeralds, too. Because emeralds are important. And we got more arrows, so... We're actually doing pretty good now on arrows. Alright. And, of course, more enemies are going to attack. Let's see what we got this time. Two zombies. Two skeletons. A creeper that's running away. I like how that ocelot's, like, trying to get out of the... Aww. I was almost going on a perfect run. I like how that ocelot's like trying to get out of the room and every single time he like starts a move, I just go like move over there. Alright. Alright, the hardest part isn't this like enemies in the room. The hardest part is actually finding the enemies in the room. Ow. I just accidentally hit that ocelot. I want that strength potion. Alright, so, I guess we took care of the two side rooms. I only got 2,200 emeralds. We're going to need to work on that. Hopefully the two uh, daily seasonal challenges. It's like such like a long thing to say, but hopefully that uh, has a prospector one on it. That'd be nice. Right, just take care of these guys that way. I don't have to worry about them coming up behind me. That's right, I haven't called my sheep in all. Really? Spiders, man. I tell you what. Did get swiftness, though. Swifty, swifty, swifty five. Give me that apple. Getting some good emeralds here. Yep. Okay. <laughs> that is by far my favorite enemy. The blow, 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 blow. Alright, getting some good souls, too. Just good, because probably come the boss, we're probably going to need them. Come back here. It's basically just me running after everybody at this point. Spiders run away from me. Skeletons run away from me. Nobody wants to be my friend. Alright. That was kind of hoping for a multi-era there. Oop, strength potion. Alright, want to go that way, so we're going to go this way. Just looks like there's a single room over here, and there's already a chest. More mercenary armor. Double shadow brew, but we did get some more arrows, so... Really? And it looks like another enemy's attack me room. Alright, bring it on, boys. Let's see what you got. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Dead. <laughs> and dead. I like how they are dropping food pretty consistently because it seems like you're poisoned pretty often in this world. So, it's like you're constantly regenerating and you're constantly poisoned. So, that's at least fair, you know? These armored skeletons are kind of tough. Alright, that guy is actually getting easier and easier. 
All right, finally have over a hundred arrows. Finally, Kitty. <laughs> Kitty, go bye bye. All right, so now we gotta head on over here. I don't know how big this world is. Like, it kind of feels like we should almost be done, but at the same time, like, there we go. I got that oak wood armor. Oh. Go ahead, do some of that. Clear all them. Alright. Now we're rolling. If I can get rid of these, all these spiders pretty quickly. Seem, seems like I can just kind of walk. I will take that shadow, bro. I don't think I need it, but seems like we're just kind of walking through right now, which is good. I'm also level 64, if that helps, because I somehow keep on leveling up. I don't know how. Okay. Of course, I get stuck in a spider web. I almost feel as if there's something over here because there's so many enemies. So I guess we'll go check out this corner here real quick. If anything, I'll at least get attacked by a bunch of mobs, which it looks like is going to happen. <sighs> okay. Oh, gosh. Well, at least I'm getting some emeralds. Had to, of course, use, you know, my beacon, but, oh well, it is what it is. Alright, so it looks like we got a room over here to the left we gotta go explore. Got some supplies over here. I grab those, because it's arrows. What is these things? I don't know if those count as actual enemies, but I know these do, because these things are super annoying. Once you get close to them, though, they really don't seem to do anything to you. Hit the button... All right, let's go. Okay, I guess <clears throat> let's not go check that out over there. Water break. Behold the jewel. Beholding. Survive the ambush. That's all like I've been having happen. I just keep getting ambushed. This is just a bunch of zombies though. I have a feeling this is going to get harder. Yep, there they are. Alright. Not too bad so far. Those two jungle guy things, whatever they are, they are kind of tough. I will give them credit. No, get back here. Get back here, mister. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, gosh. Okay. Get back here, Mr. Spider. Alright, so... Ooh, a little secret world over here. Grab that and that. And that. Alright, so... It's basically just a giant square. A bunch of enemies. It's like, ah, oh, a nice peaceful spa day, and then you just get swarmed by enemies. Oh. Thought I killed that guy. I didn't think I was wrong. Okay. Okay, they're all done. So this is just a whole bunch of, like, ambush rooms. I don't know if I like this level. It's just pretty much the same thing over and over again. Okay. All right, we got a chest. Let's see what we got. Ocelot armor. We'll take all those. All right. Anything up here worthwhile? Nope, but I did level up. That is a good thing because that gives me an enchantment point. Ha! Ah. Okay. Oh, kind of got lucky there. All right, I'm going to regen here. 
I'm gonna go check this corner real quick. I have a ton of swiftness. Wow. Oh. I just came over here to get poisoned, evidently, because there's nothing over here. Wonderful. But anyways. My sheep keeps dying in this world. I think it's time to upgrade my sheep. I think I do need an iron golem to get an achievement, though. Alright, mercenary armor, a wind horn. Uh, I think that wind horn is an achievement. I could, like, pick up, like, five enemies with it or something. I do have the ice wand, which I think there's an achievement to, like, kill four enemies with it. Ah, uh, we'll have to do that one, too. But so far, hey, I bet you this is another ambush room. I'm going to pick up emeralds. Hey, look, it's another ambush room. Get in here, sheep. Oh, I got a white sheep. All right, they're all gone. Got Mr. Armored Zombie over here. Get rid of the spiders. Take the Shadow Brew. And I bet you it's emeralds. Hey! It's just fine by me. Because like I said, we definitely need emeralds. So, I guess we run on down here now and... See what we can get ourselves into. Completely missed that swing. Just a swing and a miss. Sneaking up behind him here. Alright, these flower things have got to go. Grab me some shadow brew. Somehow that... Oh gosh, it's poison. All right. Thankfully, I haven't had to really pop a potion too, too much. I have been using this party shaker religiously on this level, though. That extra thousand damage per swing, like, really helps. All right, so I guess we're heading over this log here. All right. Oh, gosh. I just almost got completely wrecked there. I'm gonna take that. Good thing I popped that potion in time. All right, get that melon. All right, I can go left or right. I'm gonna go left. Should have went right. Ooh, there you go. Now I'm getting a pretty good roll. Oh yeah, look at that. Aside from the consistent poisoning, doing pretty good. My sheep like is like the focal point of the the poison plant things. I do all right. Okay. Oh gosh. Can't have any of that. Okay, I gotta be careful. My souls here. That was kind of a lot. But. I didn't want to get attacked by those enchanted zombies. Because, you can, I mean, who knows how powerful they really are. What in the world? Alright, I just gotta start wrecking face here. Like I said, I, I only start to get worried when I get under 100 arrows. And I kind of just looked at them while I was kind of getting through there. Do some of that. I am gonna grab this, and we'll just... Give me an extra 15 seconds on that. All right. They're all gone. They're all gone. All right. Yeah, see, now it's kind of like we're rolling here. I ain't got to use a ton of arrows. I just got to gotta get the majority of the enemies gone with the arrows. And then, uh, can I roll that? I can roll that. How much poison can I withstand? Oh, there's an apple. Oh my gosh. Okay. I think I have a second of peace and quiet here. 
I got some emeralds. I am just literally, as soon as I can activate this party shaker, hitting it again. Is this an enchanted... Where is it? Oh, there's the enchanted mob. As I say, I kept seeing the... Thankfully, I got that strength potion. Oh, gosh. Okay. I got lucky there, because he got stunned. Okay, is that everybody? Okay. Need another sheep, because my sheep just seem to keep getting decimated on this level. Like, absolutely destroyed. Do have a... Uh, wow. We just reached the splice chest. All right. So, evidently, we got a bit more to keep going here. Come back here. Oh, I need this. All right, now I can start wrecking here. Kind of took off everything that gave me, like, the swiftness boost. Ow. All right. Nothing's, like, really dropping any potions for me here. Take some of that, and then we'll just go ahead and more arrows. Cool. I'm like getting like a one to ten return on my arrows right now. Which I'm not complaining about the button. Wow, that guy does a ton of damage. I think it said like 733. Like that was an, a not messing around amount of damage. All right, I hit a button. I don't know what it did, but I hit a button. I don't know how strong the abomination is, so I would like to kind of... So there's like a door here. I don't know if there's a door here. Alright, so there's another button. Alright. And then... I'm going to take that. So is there any more buttons? Am I missing something? I don't know. I'm going to see what's in this room over here real quick before I start to get a little like, where is everything at? Alright, so, so far as this, give me that melon, thank you. Alright, so just walking through right now, I don't know if there's more... I am literally hitting this guy. Get out of my... What am I stuck on? I like how I couldn't target those plants. That was really cool. That was neato. Alright, hit that. Really? Alright. I was going to say, if all that spawns is one skeleton to uh, unlock that door, I'm going to be so mad. Alright. At least I got an apple. Get me some health back. I got to see about putting our enchantment point on. I kind of forgot about it. At the same point, I kind of didn't. But, alright. So we got that room done. I'm going to assume... That was quick and easy. I assume this other button here lowers that bridge, and then we go grab the key. But we have to fight, of course, more enemies in our millionth ambush room. It would be nice if it was just one wave. Solbo. Ooh. Wow! That was a pretty effective arrow there, if I do say so myself. More emeralds! So now we go grab the key. And now we begin our journey back to the door. Just don't hit me because I don't have to run back there. Alright. Go ahead, get some experience. Oh boy.
All right, so I'm gonna assume that this is like a puzzle almost. So I'm gonna have to like, that button. And then, okay. So evidently we solved that puzzle, that was, Let's go see what's down here. Oh wow, a giant cave. So it looks like this episode might be about an hour. <laughs> Got my way. Note to self, pick stuff with speed boost. At least my souls are catching up here. Ooh, back just cracked a good amount. I know you guys didn't hear that, but felt good. <laughs> Pick up some oak wood armor. Stop it. Stop it. This is just like a whole bunch of single enemies. Oh gosh. It's like labyrinth. Yeah, this is definitely like a maze. Oh, here's a chest. More ocelot armor. That was cool because I activated my thing. Yep. All right. Can I just be bopping through these rooms here? Ow, right in my face. All right. Oh, that's nice. So it's like, oh, okay. You just walked in here. So now we're going to spawn a billion enemies. You got strength potion. Ugh. All right. Stop with the blah, 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 blah. All right, so I guess we're now on to part two of the labyrinth. All right, is there anything in this room? Absolutely not, but there is a chest over there. So we got that in our sights, if you will. All right. Glad I kind of figure out how to open that puzzle up. It's cool whenever you know you figure stuff out on your own. Do I have a party shaker left? Pretty sure their hands like get stuck in the ground or something. Okay. Oh, that like didn't exist. I'm going to assume I have to do some of that. I have to do some of that. I have to do some of that. Oh my gosh. Oh. Kind of got a little big for my britches there. Do some of that. More ocelot armor. All right, now I guess we're down here onto this big room. This kind of almost looks like a boss battle arena. I don't know, though. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Can I hit something? I have, like, that spawn protection for, like, ten seconds. Stop it. Another level up. Yeah, I'm not complaining, but yeah, swiftness. All right, so that door opened. We got even more ocelot armor. Jeez, I'm gonna just double check here, make sure there's nothing we missed. Since I have the swiftness potion, does not appear so. So now I guess we do go in door number one. Drops you out right here. Perfect. All right. All right. Now we're rocking in and rolling. So we just got basically a couple more sets of ocelot armor, which is fine because ancient hunt grind for 500 gold. <laughs> oh, gosh. Stop with the screen shake. 
Oh, they're giving me arrows, so. Well, Drift and Ziggy was right about axes. That little swing motion is actually very useful later on. What? Well, that was cool. Strength potion just disappeared. It's fine. I didn't want it anyways, so. You know, who am I to complain? Alright, let's see. Is there... I just keep running up here? I feel like I just keep running up here. I'll pop my party shaker. Uh, that was probably a bit too early. So this is basically just like fight your way up here and then go back down to the beginning. Oh, this one actually puts the chest in the right area. Alright, let's see what we got here. More Ocelot armor. Oh my gosh. Alright, bridge over troubled water. And I am going to assume this is where the abomination domination something... Hitting him. Oh. All right. Note to self. Huh. Ow. So, this is basically going to be another one of those bosses where it's. Gotta get some burn damage on him. Okay, I'm about to die. Oof. Ah! Okay, I died like after his fist was in the ground. Alright, well at least he's on his last health bar. This shouldn't be too bad now. Pop my sheep out. Party shaker, and he's done. I wish I would stop being poisoned. Okay, I got a trick bow. All that for a trick bow. Yay. And now I guess we have to fight our way out of here. I'm just going to start launching arrows. Give me that. All right, some more arrows. Arrows make everything easier. Especially whenever you get the divergent one that like splits like eight different ways. Oh, yeah, that big guy hits kind of hard. All right, and that appears to be it. Easy 50 gamer score. That wasn't too bad. I mean, I did die once, but... Yeah, that was uh, Abomination Domination, of course. And pretty easy 50 gamer score. I didn't think the level was too, too bad. This video is kind of long, though. But tomorrow's video, guys, we're going to be getting the seasonal cape, which is like the birthday thing for Minecraft Dungeons being one year old. So let's go ahead and see what our item is. And it is... Another Windhorn! <laughs> Great. So, all right, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video and achievement. If you did, please remember to leave a comment, hit the like button, and as always, subscribe. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.